Hello everyone. Uh, I wanted to make this more in-depth video on my PC on how to use Discord. So for Patreon members, in the Patreon app, or wherever you view the Patreon posts and podcasts, Real Life Real Crime posted a link to join the Discord server. To accept that invite to the Discord server, you must have a Discord account and you must have Discord either on your PC, which is what I'm currently on, or on your phone, which I also use. Once you download Discord using your PC or your phone and you accept the link, you accept the invite to Real Life Real Crime, you will be in the Real Life Real Crime Discord. And this is for patron members only. So on on the PC, it will look a little different than on the phone, but I also made another video showing the phone, how it looks a little bit different. So on the left here, you'll see all the Discord servers you are in. You will only see real life, real crime if this is your first time using Discord. I'm in multiple Discord servers, so and you can also add other servers and join other servers if you're invited to them. But we're focusing on real life, real crime. <clears throat> These are text channels. Clicking on text channels, and it's the same on the phone, you'll it'll scroll down and you can see all the text channels that we currently have. And more will be added, and these can change at any time. It's just a general overview of what's going on. Clicking on general will bring you here to the general chat, where everyone at the moment is typing. What's everyone doing? Everyone's typing here. Everyone's posting pictures of their dogs. It's a good old time. Uh, Woody's in here typing and uh, talking to all of us. Um, here in the bot commands is a place where you can play music and podcasts. For example, <clears throat> you can type in exclamation point play space and you can copy and paste any YouTube URL in here, and a rhythm bot will appear in the podcast music bot as long as you're in that channel. I'm going to go back to that, and I'm going to show an example of it. So, going to announcements. Announcements will be posted here, like Woody posted that he would be going live tonight. And um, I will be changing this to where only Woody can type in here, since... This is just an announcement channel. Here is real life photos. No one has used it yet, but I just thought it'd be cool to just post your real life photos if you want to, so everyone kind of sees what you look like. Book them. Um, I know there's a Facebook group for the book people who uh, share cr uh, true crime novels and they talk about books and stuff, so I added that channel as well. Here is a view only channel. No one can type in it, or they should not be able to type in it. Um, and these are all the rules that um, will, will be posted and can be updated. So again, clicking on text channels, you can only see this general channel right here. You have to actually click on the word text channels to scroll down all the different channels that you can access. But general chat will be mostly the one used by everyone. This is where everyone throughout the day is just typing, saying hello, what's up, here's my dog, here's my cat. Um, and also, uh, Woody and the real life crime crew can like come in here and talk. See, this is Woody right here. Um, his battery's about to die. <laughs> so voice channels, clicking on voice channels. Let's, let's get rid of this. So there's not much clutter on the screen. Clicking on voice channels allows for multiple voice channels that we have, general and podcast music bot. So if I come into general here, sorry Renee, but I'm gonna come in here and try and speak to you. I'm gonna click this and it will put me in this channel with her. Hey, what's up? Oh, I'm muted, hang on. Hey, what's up? Okay, but you can kind of see how it is. Uh, anyone can come into this general voice channel and um, they can talk and yes. And while in this general voice channel, you can also turn on a video. I'm gonna mute myself so that way she doesn't hear me. But you can do video to turn on your camera. 
and this is me. Hello. Oh, my hair is crazy. And if she was, she could also turn on her camera. Last night we did this with Woody. I think up to 25 people can share video at the same time. But, and you can turn off your camera using this. But anyone, we can have hundreds of people in this voice chat. So I'm going to disconnect. I'm going to quickly go to YouTube. And I'm going to search Real Life Real Crime Podcast. Now, any YouTube video, doesn't have to be Real Life Real Crime. It could be um, a song, whatever you want. I'm going to copy this link, and I'm going to go back here. Using the bot commands, I'm going to first put myself in the podcast music bot voice channel. And using bot commands, I will do exclamation mark, play, space, and I'm going to copy that URL, and it's going to find it. And a rhythm bot will appear. Let me turn this one down. As you see, this rhythm bot appeared, and it's playing this podcast now. Anyone who joins this music channel with me can hear this. And let's just say I want podcasts to play for the next... <clears throat> I don't know, a couple hours, right? Let me go back to the real life, real crime. And let's just say I want, uh, say I want Rapids Burning next, right? So I'm gonna copy that link, exclamation mark play, and I'm gonna paste it. And it is queued, positioning queue one. After this is done playing, and we're gonna go ahead and mute it so you can hear me. After this, Rapids Burning is done playing, it will automatically play this one. Um, I'm sorry, after Courtney Coco Part 2 is done playing, it will automatically play Rapids Burning 3. And this is just a little feature, and like I said, you guys, you can play and you can uh, copy any URL to any song, whatever you want. People can come in here and share their favorite music, um, etc. When I leave the channel, the rhythm bot stays. Anyone who goes into this channel can hear this rhythm bot. Uh, let me turn it up. I'm going to go back into it. Real cry on the podcast. And as you can Make see, you can hear it. Descriptions of acts of violence. To do this, what I'm doing now, you right click and you can change the volume. For people that are 18. And you can also do this to anybody. If you go into this general chat and Renee here, uh, I'm, I'm sorry to use you. I hope you're okay with it. It's too loud. Right click on her and lower her volume. And this is locally for you. It, it doesn't change her actual volume. It just kind of lowers it for you. So you're not, you know, so it's not hurting your ears. What I saw. So I'm going ahead and just disconnect from this voice channel. And I'm going to go back to general chat. Okay, sorry, that was a lot of information. This is the easiest I can think of kind of giving you some info on what to do. You can also at people. So I'm going to at Renee since I've been using her. And I'm a uh, hello. Now she will get a notification if she's using an iPhone or her cell phone. All these people are using phones. You can see she'll get a notification saying that I just tagged her in a chat. Okay. Um, if you at everyone, be careful because it will tag everyone, all hundred people in here. Um, so I, I I don't recommend using this unless you have something very important to say. Um, see, Renee just replied to me, hey, so she got the, um, she got my tag. Anyway, that's it. I'm hoping this video works out. Um, I'm using a new program to record. Um, good luck, everyone, and I'll, I'll try and make more videos, and the more updates we have, uh, thanks.